I'm Davey. I'm Misty. DM Watts. Unscripted. Unedited. Unapologetic. Let's get it. What is going on, everybody? I am Davey. I'm Misty. And welcome to another episode of DM Watts Podcast. So, I mean, wow. Uh, and, and that's all you can say. Yeah, that's, that's really all that we it's can say wow. right now is wow. So Donald I Trump. I popcorn down. I know, right? He's guilty. They found him guilty on all 34 counts. counts. 34 counts. Like, that is, wow, that's that's crazy. So it, is, it has never happened before in American history. So we literally witnessed history today. So we are all literally a part of, of history in this in this standpoint. Like one day our children or children's children may look back and be like, wow, like, yeah, I was there when it's, that happened. Well, uh, and that's the thing. I mean, and, and at this point, it's just another damn day in America. It is, <laughs> it's, that is true. With at this point, it's another this day in no America. No president this and, yeah, uh, and once in a lifetime event. Yeah, and, yeah. You know, from. Uh, never from in history. <laughs> the the skies to yeah. to our world it, and the leaders in it it's yeah. just never mm-hmm. flipping ending mm-hmm. so no matter where you are um it, it's crazy i know you're looking at it like shaking your head either you're rejoicing or you're like man this sucks like this is this is foul so either way you have to agree it's crazy it's crazy like, this no matter thing, how every, you feel about it you're like this is, is nuts broken. yeah <laughs> it, it's just broken it's like feed yeah. them all the drama all yeah, the time give it all every to day them. Uh, you, you got you just there's yeah. so much but yeah. um i would just like to to say a few things go ahead um, one he is now considered a convicted felon that's true which means he Can't cannot vote. he cannot Can't vote, vote right. at least in the state of florida i believe he's not going to be able to vote which he's a resident um until his sentence is satisfied which is yeah. what's happening now yeah. you know and we're we're for that like yeah. i i don't think that's something that should happen i think everybody should get to vote yeah uh and especially if they've they've <coughs> done their time um yeah. but uh the also this is a fun fact you ready mm, for this yeah one? i'm listening if trump is sentenced to prison uh-huh. no matter for how long whether it be a, a weekend or a year mm-hmm. or longer the secret service will be there with him <laughs> that's crazy they have well, to. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's they, they literally. They're have not going to gonna leave it up like, to the warden and well, the, those no, guards. It's but once yeah. you're a president, so yeah. just because he's convicted doesn't mean he's yeah. going to lose any privileges that come with the yeah, office. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, once you leave the office, yeah. this is what it is, and you get yeah. protected till you die. And <clears> so, uh, yeah. Wow, that's that's crazy because you, you know you, you didn't even think about that. Did, I didn't. You know, you have to look at a lot of things. That's but that's what we talk about. Hey, being on the side of history, like and we this pay is, for that. Yeah, we pay for that. So you know, we pay yeah. for the jails, we pay mm-hmm. for the prisons, we pay for the, the food, judicial system, um, and we pay for the secret service. Yeah. So no matter uh, how you look at it, you know, it it's crazy. It's what's just happening. Insane. What happened? It, it's crazy. But we gonna. Whether whether it does anything or not, it's still insane. Yeah, and I'm not even gonna get there because you know then we were were reading articles because immediately yeah. you know it's like okay what yeah. is everybody saying, and so far the the one that made me go huh mm-hmm. uh, was um, the fact that you know the judge has to be now has the weight of America yeah, on, on, on his yeah. so- shoulders. Yeah, this is this is different for it. Because, it's like, you, know, you he, could... If you do this, this yeah. is going to happen. If you don't do that, this is going to yeah. happen. Like, people argue that uh, Nixon being pardoned was yeah. a bad thing for America. Okay. Instead yeah. of it being a, a mercy thing, and even though, you know, because there was... <laughs> there was pure evidence yeah, that, the, yeah, the, yeah. that the president did what he did. Mm-hmm. Um, and so people were like, hey, you know, if, if you guys wouldn't have pardoned him, we would have we yeah. we would have made certain things. But again, yeah. at that time, the political lines <coughs> were very divided, right. just like they are now. And media was divided, just like it is now. Yeah. And so it's one of those, you know, which way do you go? And I thank God I'm not a judge. Man, it, it, right now it is it's a tough time to be. Whether you're political or non-political, it's, uh, it's, just, to it's just tough to be an American right now. It really is. Because it seems like no matter how you feel about the situation, yay or nay, he did it, he deserved to be punished, or he had he didn't do this, it, blah, blah, blah. It's like the opinion you have nowadays can it gets you into more than just an argument. And it's crazy. Yeah, it's, it's just, crazy it's, now. It's really, 
nobody on either side can sit here and say, oh, yeah, I feel totally safe. No, you don't. No, no. Yep. no you don't. Yep. None, none of us do. Yep. So, so move, moving on. All right. We're going to we move on. We just had to say that. We had to get that out. That's what's going on right current now. Current events. Current, that, that's the current event. That it, was insane. It, it happened as we were getting ready to come down here to record this. We were literally Yeah, we're like, well, I guess we got something to say. <laughs> and then that happened. Yeah, it was we're like, like, well, wow. okay. Yeah. Something's going on. Yeah, I, I just I uh, something's going, going to on. Be protected in prison if yeah, he goes. Yeah, I heard that. So what we got? <clears throat> going to our topic. Yeah, let's see what the we fish get. bowl. Um. Ooh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Wait. What we get? Okay. The fish bowl topic for today is: Are you more concerned about doing things right or doing the right thing? Oh, I love this topic. I, I will say That's that. I do love this topic. Uh, Are you more concerned about doing things right or doing the right things? Is that what it was? Yeah, doing the right thing. Okay. I, I, yep. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt. No, no, no. Go ahead. Go. Hey, go ahead. But yeah, I'm, I'm definitely more concerned about doing the right thing. That's why I ran for office. That's why uh-huh. I, you know, advocate for people. That's why I am Super Saiyan Karen, um, mm-hmm. because things need to be done right. There's a system in place. Mm-hmm. There's procedure in place, and it concerns me when things aren't honored. Because when they're not, then you get the mess we're in right now. I heard that, man. Either Uh, side of the aisle, we're in a mess. Yeah, yeah. And when you don't follow procedure and you don't follow decorum and you don't follow the rules, this is what you get. You get a jumbled mess of a divided house, and it will not stand, and it's scary. So, yeah, I'm more concerned about... About doing well, it's the a right way. Dis- different type of uh, divisiveness that we're, that, we're, that we're talking about now with that yeah. with that part. So you know what I mean? And so, it's but bad. <coughs> yeah. So I mean, I agree. So doing doing the right thing because you just because you're doing something, hey, that is that, that is viewed as right, is it the right thing? Because innately, we know when something feels off. All of us, you know, know when like, hey, is this? Well, really, yeah, well, like, your like, hold on, is this really good and, with what I'm what I'm thinking on doing here? Seriously, in the last like month, uh-huh. you and I have been in instances where this example was, I mean, too many times yeah. where this is like, okay, are we gonna do, you know, are we gonna say something because we want to be right, or are we right. gonna say something because we this want, the, you know, to do the right thing? Do the right thing, right? Because it, it it's. When we start talking about doing the right thing, okay, well, I think one of the great, okay, a good example of this is driving past a homeless person, right? Like, the people was, okay, doing things right versus doing the right thing, right? And that this is such a controversial thing here. It's like, okay, so am I doing the right thing by giving this in- individual uh, money? Or am I just doing, uh, doing this thing that is right? So is it, in your in yourself, given with your whole heart, because you feel the need to help this person, well, or yeah, just it like comes hey, down to a morality thing, right? Or is it hey, he been staring at me the whole or, time, or your your own <laughs> convictions? And, yeah, yeah, exactly. or he been staring at me the whole time. But like, is it necessarily, you know? I mean, I don't know. I I think. I mean, that's just one example, though. I mean, so yeah. So I, I mean, so it. It's still though, even though I've read it. Uh huh. It's still because are you more concerned? I have to read it out aloud again, yeah. guys. This we, is my I gotta process. Keep, I, no, I got to keep looking at it. Welcome too. to Misty's the, mind. I got to keep looking at it too because it looks so like okay. Read it again. About doing things right or doing the or right thing. doing the right the right things. things. See, right. I'm cons- that's the problem though, and I think that's why I keep reading it. I'm concerned with both. Okay. I really am because I'm concerned with procedure and following it and making sure that it, you know, rules are followed. Mm-hmm. But then there's times that you have to do the right thing, and that sometimes means going over that person's head or skipping that step because you're going to do, you know, the right thing and helping that person. So, and, and I like that. So it's like <clears throat> uh, you're giving an example of the situation we're in. Like, hey, you've been, we've been helped. But we haven't been helped the right way it's supposed to be uh, done. Yeah, they're not following. They're, 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 right. they're not. Fo- they're following procedure without right. looking at their policy. Right. 
right. for what to do in case of this. Exactly. And so where it, you know, and so right. when something says, hey, in case of this, you cannot follow procedure. Right. And and to see people still follow procedure and act as if that in case of isn't there. Right. In case of emergency, break glass. Right. And so it's it, annoying. It's frustrating. Right. And at that point, we jump over people's head and we're like, man, yep. nope, you're still not listening. This is your policy. Yep. Uh, <laughs> I think in a good example Super of that, if you if you get confused about something like that, let's put it this way. If you owe somebody money or if you borrow their stuff, like, you know, doing things right, uh, doing doing the right thing is use it, give it back. Right? Replenish, and, fix, right, whatever. Right. Just bring it back shinier. I feel like fill we, it with gas. Either you are the person or you know the person who Come borrows your stuff. And then uh, next thing you know, you have to come to them because they had it for so long because you need it. And they've had it for so long. And you're like, hey, you got that uh, you got that lawnmower or whatever I, I let you borrow? Like, y'all ain't never, like, look, we joke about comedians, but I've had those people where you let them borrow something and they've had it for so long. Yeah. When you go to them, they're like, what are you talking about? Yeah. Like, no, I've been had this. And I've been the, on the other side of that, yeah. too. I just plumb <laughs> forgot. <laughs> yeah. Whatever, well, yeah, you got to remind, no, it's mine. This is mine. Yeah. I need you to give it back. And then it's like they give it back feeling that they did the right thing. No, you just did things right after I told you. Well. <laughs> the right thing. You did, it's not the same doing thing. Doing the right thing, like with a, a lawnmower or something. Yeah. It's borrowing it. And bringing it back cleaned and full of gas. Mm. Like we had an incident where we were using someone's little um, tree trimmer right, right. saw thing, power saw, and the chain broke or yeah, was yeah, dull. Yeah, yeah, the chain was very dull. And so we went and got a new chain and yeah. tuned it up and yep. did everything we could so it came back better than yeah because that's they the right. still they you know they still allowed us to borrow it so to me that's not only doing things right but it but was it also doing the right it thing. was doing the right thing right so and, and in some so instances it is in some instances it, this can be both you know and so, but not every instance but in some instances this can be both like right. the examples we just gave you know but i, I think the you know the the first one like with the the homeless situation was like uh well you know what no the one we're talking about that we're just not speaking on is, is when we talk about hey we're dealing with an organization that when we finally get them to do something they f they feel like they hey hey we did this right no you did the right thing after i told you you you're doing it right but it's not the right thing to do because well, now well okay so military okay how many times did you have to make that decision though you would have had to have made that decision you had to follow procedure to do it right mm -hmm. but it didn't necessarily mean for you it was the right thing to do R well okay that's a good one yeah <laughs> so, i mean so i like that that's one life's like, dilemma. Yeah. yeah it is and you know we i i in my entire uh military career i met one uh conscientious the objector or whatever those i think that's what they call them the ones like no, i Conscientious objector, where they're like, "No, I won't kill anybody. I won't hold a weapon." Oh, okay. Or anything okay. like that. Yeah. yeah, yeah so, yeah. and it, it's like, "Hey, it's, it's it's not right. You know what I mean? Right. It's not right to do." It's like, "Okay, I can, uh, I can, hey, you, I can get in, in into your religion or whatever. You're saying, yep. hey, I'm doing, yeah, you know, uh, I'm doing the right thing. But did you do it right by signing up? Well, there you go. <laughs> but did you do it right? But what like did you, you sign si up for? Yes, you signed up. <laughs> so and you're following procedure. Yeah. yeah. But why that wasn't yeah. doing necessarily the right don't, thing. Don't come to a job that you know you're going to have to pick up arms. Like you should have been a chaplain or and something. Not, where you knew you weren't well, going to. Yeah. And yeah. that would maybe yeah. that's what, you know, that yeah. should have been done. And and maybe the person wanted to be and, yeah. and for whatever reason mm -mm, wasn't. Mm -mm. Oh, no, they didn't. No, no, this individual knew what he wanted to be. Did but didn't realize there was a second part to that job. Like, hey, yeah, you're you, we deploy, you we hold up, up weapons. Arms. Yeah, we, we hold up weapons, and there's a possibility that everybody in the military may have to do that. You never know. There's always that possibility. Well, and I mean, again, it, just being in the military, it doesn't matter if you're front lines or you know part of that air crew. You're still aiding in 
Yeah. I mean, why that, sign? No, no, no. If, that's, that is true. You're still that aiding is true. in it. If if you you're still a part of the mission. Yeah, yeah. So and and and, and so it is. You a, can't make that. You can't do that. You can't. All of a sudden, I've got to. Yeah. That's crazy. That just <laughs> trip. I'm sorry. The the fact that someone yeah, would do that. Yeah, that's a that's a that's a crazy I, thing. I can't. I yeah. can't get with that. So you know where I believe this would also be a dilemma, with those people who whether no matter what religion it is those people that knock on your door uh that they, they want to talk have a talk about you know the jehovah's what, witness yeah, whether it's jehovah witness whereas it's mormons or the or mormons like that, that. want to clean our yard right. yeah so <laughs> so you know there they feel they're knocking on door to door and talking to people about god they're is doing the, the right, right thing. thing to do yeah right but are they doing things right are they not in this yeah, day and that's age. what i'm saying are they even nope. even even some some uh, Christians well, too. Well, even when I was running, they want to do the right thing. Well, but even when I was running for office, is knocking on the door the best way to introduce y- yourself yeah, to people yeah. to strangers? Yeah. So you want to do the right thing, but yeah. do you are you more concerned of doing things right or doing the right thing? If you dis if you disagree with me on something, uh, the right thing to do is respectfully disagree. That you're, is the right thing to that do. That is the right thing we to do. Dis- yes, we disagree versus, respectfully. Right. Instead of instead of doing things right, they're actually that's just plain out wrong to all of a sudden choose violence. But yeah, <laughs> but, but no, I mean, like you're saying, knocking on doors, being a mission, mm-hmm. that kind of stuff. Right. There, so I can see where that perspective, at least for us looking from the outside, it yeah. looks like they're doing the right thing for them. Yes. But not necessarily doing things the right way. Exactly, because if you've ever opened your door and let one of them people in, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I have. Yeah, if you've Just ever, for fun. if you've ever opened the door and let one of them people in, uh, you, you, this is when you look at this car like I'm, I'm trying to do this right, mm-hmm. but I don't know if it's the right thing. <laughs> Well, I mean, and that's a whole other, I mean, that's like talking about politics. That's a whole other rabbit hole when we're talking about uh, people's religion. Yeah. Because at least in the Christian faith, it clearly states that he who does not believe in the law cannot be upheld by the law. Hey, but hey, what do we know? So (laughs) the fact that you're knocking on someone's door. What do we know? We're just the honest. Hell bent (laughs) on. Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> Making them become a Christian yeah, is them. against tell the them. whole. Yeah. So, and that, point. but see, and that's a, that's the thing. So it's, this isn't <sighs> this isn't to stir up any controversy or anything like that. It's just no. It's hey, just, it, but it's true though. It you is I mean? true. It is it is true though. It is it is true. We get. I mean, man. Okay, right now, with, with what's going on in in the, in the world and stuff like that, like we're the dumpster fire yeah, that is Earth. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like to refer to yeah, it as. The dumps the fire that is earth. Yeah. What's going on it? in the world that all these different wars, you know, based off of, you know, their beliefs and all these right. different things based off like, hey, you know, there's a right thing to do there. And it's not doing things right is not <laughs> let's let's go kill each I don't, other. I just yeah. Yeah. So there's so many There's so many things. There's so many things. Yeah, yeah. It is it is so many and it it is it's scary. Because most people feel that they're doing both. Well, I do. Yeah, yeah. Most people feel that they are doing both. I've been uh, telling, you know, one of our kids, yeah. no, <laughs> we got to go through procedure. Yeah, there yeah, are yeah. procedures in place, and yeah. we are going to run the gauntlet yeah. of procedure to get the right thing done. And, and that that's another one right there. So this, this, this generation, love to go zero to 100 real quick. That's because they watch their parents go zero to 100. That too. That too, though. But they don't understand, though, because they're coming in and not seeing the parent. Uh Uh-huh. What the gauntlet they ran through Mm -hmm. before they got to the point of, I'm unhinged. Yeah, to you it looked like zero to 100. So then the kids came in and just saw Mama unhinged again. And then pouring a glass of wine and lighting a smoke. Yeah. And like, oh, this is what I'm supposed to be doing with my life. <laughs> and then became unhinged as a generation. <laughs> and, and and now this current generation. Oh, yeah, 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 which yeah. is a lot a lot of complaints that, you know, business owners or just adults, period, with this no generation. Respect. There's none. I get and no it, respect. Yeah, man. And it's it's like you're wanting uh doing things right, you feel, 
I filled out an application that this I did the thing right. And the right thing to do is demand way more than what anybody else is paid. <laughs> right? The right thing to do is like, nah, so I'm only going to do this. I don't do that. I, I, don't, I don't, nah, I don't, I don't do this. Like, it was in your job description. And, you know, there's, <laughs> well, there's times at, at jobs, you know, like uh, we were talking about, you know, being a manager at, at hotels and resorts mm-hmm. and stuff like that. At some point, you have to, as yeah. a manager, just say, hey, I'm going to do the right thing here yeah. because maybe a lot of people were affected or there was a storm or something. Yeah, yeah. Something beyond everybody's control happened. And you as a manager standing there arguing yes. that you're only going to give people a coupon for already free breakfast <laughs> is not <laughs> the way to do it. Like, no, just, hey, I'm going to give you 50 percent off of everybody's room or. <laughs> I'm going to give you a free night. You know, that's and that's the right thing to do. It's not necessarily procedural or <laughs> or going up, you know, being concerned about uh-huh. doing things yeah. right because you, no hotel is going to say give them a free night. Have you been on the receiving end of this? Maybe. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Cuz you're real detailed with this. Maybe. Have you been on the receiving end of perhaps. the, of the exact I've been on both thing. ends of this. I have been the complainee <laughs> and the complainer. Yeah, I mean, that's fine. I was just going to like, wow, this I is have very been the manager elaborate. and, and the person <laughs> that has gone 100 on the manager. Yeah. Mm, so, mm, mm. yeah, but. it's hard. That's why I sit there and I'm like, I'm, I'm concerned with both. And I think that makes it even harder because then it makes it. Look, it's a lot easier just to go off. Yeah, it's a lot easier. It's simple to do. Just to go off and it's and, simple to do and do something out of the kindness of your heart because it's the right thing to do. Right, right. right. It's simple. But to do. it is much harder to keep composure and do things the right way. Right. And calm. with the satisfaction of burning every flipping office down at the same time, mm, mm. as you get to the point of, I did the right thing. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, okay. Like she said, because <laughs> it's because I got to say, saying. I got to say this, you know, also with this is just, you know, we have to look at things from, you know, other perspectives. I think that with a topic like this, we we can get in danger of just looking at it from our own. Well, yeah. You know what I mean? Because let's face I it, mean, hey, am I doing things right? Am I, you know, you know, versus, hey, this other individual may view this as completely wrong to them like you know what i mean like you're right completely wrong and it, or, it's of course because we don't understand it's it's going to come down to perception and and your reality of that perception so when it comes to the homeless person right that is your moral compass that is your belief system that okay. is what yeah. you think yeah. and what i think could be completely opposite yeah i mean so it comes down to this question really is about what you deem to be right because then you have to go into what is right <laughs> what does right yeah. mean for you yeah it and is. that's a perception thing yeah and, and that's where shit gets sticky you're right because what's right for some people <laughs> well today <laughs> right. there's yeah, gonna yeah. be some people that what happened was right for them there's gonna yeah. be even an equal number of people that don't believe you know it was right for them that's so true. It, it's it just you know it's like respect. It, yeah. it depends on who you're talking to, what they view respect as. That's true. So it's That's really true. everything is just sticky. Yeah, yep. and not the good kind. Man, but either way, you know, you just just be safe out there. <laughs> either no, way, I mean full disclosure. There, uh, we're like, you know, this is kind of scary. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it is. It's like, it, okay. It is. I mean, it is. Now what? I mean, <laughs> it, <laughs> so what you're right. New full fresh dis- hell is You're right. Us. Full disclosure, seeing that stuff on the news, uh, you know, the the things that have happened today, you know, with Trump and stuff like that, seeing that on the news, it is it is scary because there are people out here, you know, in, in our area, and I'm sure you got everybody have them in their area who, who will take that personally with what just happened. You know, the, yeah. the, the Trump and it's like I gotta act up. No, that's 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 not what that means, bro. That's 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 not at all what that means. You know what I'm saying? I gotta do something stupid, violent, you know, and and, and call it freedom. So like or something like that. And it's like that's not how right. that's not how that no, shit works, bro. Y'all gotta dial it back. You know what I mean? And, and make sure that people stay safe because it's. This day and age in this society, you know, it, whether you're in 
our state or or other states, man, like people's views have changed drastically. Their views of what is man. right and wrong has changed drastically. The amount of people in this case that were getting death threats, you know, it is you talk it, about the judge, the jurors, you're like, what? <laughs> You're like, what? <laughs> it, it's, yeah. You're so, like, come I mean, on. But this is obviously one of those ethical, you know, it is. It's ethical yeah. theory. It's, it's, it's a moral structure thing. Mm-hmm. And so somebody asked, do people ever do the right thing because it is the right thing? And this person answered, yes, they are called humanists, moralists, people with a conscious conscience or empaths. And I mm. always say that I am an empath because I am. And mm. it sucks. <laughs> but then give me a bone. And, man, <laughs> I'm not going to let it go yeah, until yeah. the right thing is done yeah. the right way. <laughs> it is. There's it's nothing wrong with that, baby. <laughs> Don't question me on it. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's nothing Don't wrong with me. that, man. But, hey, we had to come down here and, and – uh, and then go ahead and, uh, ahead and update y'all on what was going on. Not that you can't, you, everybody didn't get an update randomly from news or whoever, whatever news you get on your phone. But we definitely just had to talk about it. Yeah. And, and it was, it, it's just. And to pull that topic about yeah, doing yeah. the right thing. It, I mean, it totally goes with it. You've been, but, but as always, I'm going to quote, you know, Douglas Adams, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. Okay. I just watched it. So, all right. Hold on. Okay. Go ahead. Go I ahead, would rather be happy than right. Well, you are you? <laughs> no. <laughs> and that's that's like my motto, is it not? Yeah. It's my motto because yeah. I'm like I would rather be happy. The, yeah. And, and so, you know, it's it's when you see a world where you're wanting to do the right things and you're wanting to do them yeah. in the right way and nobody else takes that stance. Yeah. It's very hard to be happy. Very difficult. So That's why I'm know, happy with you, Mama. Yeah, same here, my lady. See? Same it's not here, about my lady. you. My yeah. happiness doesn't it is about you, but it's not about you because I'm happy with you. Yeah. Well, thank you, my lady. <laughs> I went there. We've been watching Outlander. Oh, my God. Tell me why. I think we said it on the last one. I'm not sure, but we're going to reiterate. Care. We're still you, on You got to watch Outlander. Bro. If you, I get it. Most people are like, don't nobody watch no stars. We're, we were Ooh, up get there. stars. We were watching this whole verdict thing get handed down, and I'm like, oh, God, yep. is this going to be like, you know, yeah. are the red coats coming now? <laughs> <laughs> like we're the Jacobites when you need yeah. them. Yeah, I'll tell you, you guys got to watch Outlander. All we're, that stuff we're saying. We're the regulators. I yeah, need the so, regulators. I'm telling you, watch that show. <laughs> watch that show. But oh god, I'm try gonna, to tear yourself away from I'm it. I'm gonna man. go hide in Scotland. I'm now. telling you. I'm telling you. Hopefully, it may be better. A little bit better there. You never know. But mm-hmm. anyway, we just wanted to come out here and do our show, guys. Thank you once again for tuning in to us. And so that's going to do it for us. So signing off for DM Watts, I am Davey. I am Misty. And y'all, we are DM Watts. Thank you for tuning in. We will catch you guys on another one. Please be safe out there. Bye. Give me kisses. Email us, DM Watts. Uh, my podcast at gmail.com. That one. <laughs> See, I, did, I didn't do it right, nor did I do the right this thing. This is awesome. It's all good. Yeah, we'll catch you on the next one. Love you, baby.